Hello and welcome to this week's video which got hijacked by next week's video, more on that later. So I wanted to begin my marketplace, but marketplace is very vague and I didn't really know where to start. But the idea is as always to start small, so I thought just making a fountain or statue or some kind of gathering, the display point, would fill out the market. And now I have a question for you. What's the best commencement or building strategy methods? I don't really know the best word to use here. But I recently heard of the concept build, destroy, repeat, which basically also just means practice. But I mean, what's your angle of entry? Like here, I knew the marketplace was my goal, but I didn't set out to build a fountain or whatever this is. I think it could be best described as a chimp randomly putting bricks together until conscious thoughts pops up. Like these random assimilation of bricks which led or inspired a whole new direction, a side quest. Hey, this will. is next week talking. Stop bumping into my shit. I did eventually manage to pull myself together and make this fountain from my marketplace. Got a cheese stand popping up here. It's probably the best one of the lot. I like the decorations on the top. And these cheese slices, they're always easy win. I got a meat guy as well. Everyone gotta have a meat guy. For some reason it's a little bit German looking, but that's okay. The best meat guys are German. Not a big fan of the length of the roof and the plainness of it, but generally it's alright. I like the little window here. Looks a little bit like a freeze room. Lastly, we have my chili guy. Gotta have a chili guy, you know, to go the meats. I like him alright. He's, he's, he's alright, you know, you can tell as a stand. I like the little chili plants at the side here, unfortunately the chilies aren't pointing down, but that'll be something I'll work on in the near future. So here we have the very first thing I did when I had the idea of making a farmer's market. It's quite simple, it's just a guy with some boxes and fruits and veg as you can see. But yeah, but once you start adding on these stalls, it starts forming a picture, and it's quickly starting to look like something I can add into my Lego city. But I actually do have some bigger plans for this here. I want to take two noodle sets and the friend sets, the cafe central perk, and build it into a grand modular and have this go around so it'll kind of be like two corner builds. It'll make sense when you see it. So stay tuned as they say. So as always, I let this play out and I'd like to thank you for watching. And please do press those uh, like buttons to help me grow the channel. And as always, have a nice day. See you later. Bye.